Hi, welcome to Blind Owl Outdoors. Today I'm going to do a real quick product review for you. Uh, these are the, I don't know what you call them, uh, match things, I guess. Uh, I'm sure they got a special name for them. Uh, where I saw them advertised, they, they didn't really have anything, uh, any special description or anything like that. I've seen them before. I've always wanted one just to see what they're like. I've seen them price anywhere from about four or five dollars, uh, all the way down to after I started looking for them on eBay, uh, I found some as low as uh, the bid started at 13 cents. So I, I put a bid for 14 cents on one, and uh, someone will bid me right away. So I didn't bother; I already had one, so it's no big deal. Oops. And there's two different styles here. This one's this one's a round one, and uh, has a, a longer. Uh, there's a little ferrule rod in this slot here and then on the end of the little shaft here there's a little piece of carbon steel that strikes on this and then there's lighter fluid in here and a little bit little bit of cloth on the uh, like the rod I guess you'd call it and then that just starts on fire. It's actually pretty slick. Um, I don't know how good the seals are on them. I had the square one for about I don't know a week and a half and I, I didn't put much lighter fluid in it. I put a little bit in there and it was kind of dry uh, the other day when I tried it so it might just leak out a little bit, evaporate. There is a little rubber o-ring uh, right about there. There's a little o-ring to seal it up and uh, this one this one came with an extra o-ring with it uh, so they probably <laughs> get broken down by the lighter fluid probably. Uh, this one's a little smarter looking, a little nicer looking, a uh, little longer reservoir. But the shaft on this one was uh, all rusty when I opened it up today. Uh, this one just came in the, the mail at the post office today. So I thought I'd show you what they're like and let me set the, the camera down here. And all you do is just un unscrew the the rod or whatever you want to call it and then as you can see there's a little striker thing on the bottom and then there's a little ferrule rod in here so all you do is just strike on it and it lights right up usually so it's pretty cool and then there's just a little bit of cloth or string on the the rod there so it's like a, a wick I guess and uh, it'd be long enough to get a fire going obviously maybe to, to light a candle or something like that you can see it's burning off there uh, actually it looked like it burned most of the the wick off there by going too long try it again once uh, be careful what you do with it I guess and then I just screw it back down and not too tight but medium tight I don't want to smash the o-ring too far uh, didn't try the round one yet. Give that a try. It has a again it has a longer uh, little miniature ferro rod on it. And it's got the same little bit of wick on the bottom of it. There you go. Three or four strikes. But it's not gonna be very good in the wind if you just blow on it comes right out so see if I can redunk it. I mean, it's not great but it's something different. But again I wouldn't rely I wouldn't rely on it until you uh, find out how long the the uh, lighter fluid lasts inside there or make sure you top it off before you go out uh, to the woods. Um, but again, ha even having this in your pack, even if it did dry up, um, having that little carbon tip on there and the ferro rod, that would be enough to uh, ignite a, a piece of cotton or something like that. So, um, 
I don't know. I, again, it's never hurts to have an extra ferro rod with you, I guess. That's, that's kind of the way I look at it. And it's just kind of novel. I thought I'd just give them, give them away and uh, might keep one or something. I got a couple more coming. Uh, I found one. I found one deal on on uh, eBay. Uh, three of them. Three of them for ninety cents. So thirty thirty cents a piece. How can you go wrong on them? I thought I'd give one to Pastor Tim and maybe a brother-in-law or something like that here, and uh, they'll get a kick out of them. Uh, you should have seen. I I, I took out some uh, strike anywhere matches and showed them to uh, my brother-in-law and then Perry. Uh, they couldn't believe them. They were they were just awed by him. So I, I went in and gave him each a handful of them, put them in a plastic bag for him to take home. Uh, they they've never seen anything like that before. So you know, stuff we take for granted. It's it's kind of novel here. All right. Well, that's all I got for a real short video. Just one quick little test and see it works real well. Uh, I got this one here. This one here was a dollar, and this one here was ninety cents. So I don't know how you can go wrong on them. Uh, thanks for watching. Please click like and subscribe. You can contact me anytime at blindowloutdoors at gmail.com. Thank you very much and have a great day.